answering the call of the youth and of the future. And everything we're doing here is to support them. Young people are the leaders. And to protect my future, I'm out here trying to change the world. Artist in residence Gon Golan has partnered with 350.org to produce two weekends of art builds to support the climate strike. These art builds provide free materials and support staff to help local kids create personalized protest signs, banners, and t-shirts. The builds are open to the general public, but outreach is focused on school-aged children who have experienced the effects of climate change directly, but who might not know about the climate strike and could benefit from working with activists and artists. Making art is about creating meaning and symbols and images and the things that really give us purpose and direction. We are painting waves for the sea of people that are going to be arriving. It's just about getting creative, getting your hands a little dirty in the moment, um, just kind of a way to feed your soul and get creative and contribute to something so much bigger than yourself. Next Friday, September 20th, three days before the United Nations Climate Summit in New York City, millions of people from over 150 countries are expected to take part in the climate strike, demanding that leaders take action against the global climate crisis. So it's not just about making the art, it's about actually going out, claiming public spaces, making sure that people's voices are heard, that their images are being seen. Even if people don't remember our messaging, if people don't remember what we were chanting, shouting at the top of our lungs, I want them to remember the thousands of banners and signs and posters that they saw. Reporting from Gowanus, Brooklyn, I'm Abigail Metch.